Ladies and gentlemen, it's the 2nd of November 2015 and I'm going to do a quick video blog for you. You may hear me use the term sheep. What is the sheep? Sheep are the people who are okay with being mediocre. Sheep are the people who don't want to improve their condition. Sheep are the people who have stayed ignorant and not questioned how and why things are the way they are. The sheep are the 99% of people you know. A few interesting things happened today. Well, a lot more than a few. But a few that were related in this sense. One was a student of mine online. It's a woman. And her manager at work commented that he or she, I don't know, didn't like her energy. Now, her energy is positive. She has made incredible gains through IMC philosophy and working out on the Fitness X online program. But her manager had a problem with it. Another one was one of my students who received a message from somebody who told her, I miss the old you. And she asked me if that was a hating comment. So I told her to go ahead and ask the person. And she messaged me and said, yes, it was. And that she said goodbye to the person and no more relationship. This student of IMC is also shining very bright. Every day. Then, another student posted how they had a Skype session with one of the trainers at Seductive Instinct, which is my company. And how the mere $300 they paid completely changed their life. And it was worth more than anything. And of course, they were attacked for spending $300 to get better. Because after all, the sheep know nobody can actually get better. And how do they know this? Because of their own miserable existence. Now, I stepped away from the sheep a long time ago. Thanks to my teacher, Manu Tupo, who passed away about 16 years ago. He opened my eyes and I have not been able to shut them ever since. I don't deal with the sheep. They're all around, but they give me a lot of space. Do you know why? Because I have zero desire to be accepted or applauded or approved by them. There will be something wrong if the sheep applauded me. There will be something very wrong. But I do expect them to shut the fuck up.
And that's the difference. Is you sit there and you argue with them. Listen, it's your life. If you're improving your life, and if things are getting better for you, every day, in every way, then there's no need to explain anything. In fact, I think if there was anybody that needed to explain, it would be the sheep. The sheep would have to explain why. They are so mediocre, so weak. Why are they such liars and cowards? They need to explain why they put up with the shitty conditions around them every day and they're okay with it. If you're doing well in life and you're improving, there's nothing to explain. Success shall be your proof. But you're still bound by a certain code. By the moral code of the sheep. Still somewhere deep inside of you, you give a shit what they think. And because of that, you suffer much more than you should. Well, I'm here to tell you that during your time, somebody lives who doesn't give a shit what the sheep think. I don't respect them. I don't want them to acknowledge me. And I expect them to get out of my way. And if they don't, then their feelings will get hurt. Because the sheep are weak. And the sheep are cowards. And the sheep are liars. And they're pointing the finger at you. And you're forgetting how miserable they are. So what you need to do is point two fingers back at them. And point that shit like you're fucking Zeus. Like you have lightning coming out of your fingers. Don't point with a timid hand. Let the sheep be timid. At some point, you have to make a decision. If you're going to own your life, and if you're going to make an improvement in your life, you're going to have to step away from the herd. Now, you may think that's scary. But the truth is, it's much scarier being part of the sheep. You have no protection. You think you do. The sheep will not defend you. They'll turn their back and run as fast as they can. They'll close their eyes to any problem you have. They have no capability to help you because they are weak. And they will backstab you at the first chance they get if it saves their own fucking hide. You're only safe amongst strong individuals. And only if you yourself are strong. I am for the strong. I'm not for the weak. I expect the weak to be worried and scared about me and my life because my life is filled with truth and filled with power. So naturally, a weak, cowardly person would be intimidated. And I know there are much, much, much more sheep than there are strong individuals. However, my videos find the strong individuals. And every one of you is worth to me more than a thousand sheep. Because one of you is capable. And one of you can make a difference. 
and Gandhi, one man, made a huge difference. And any man in history, single-handedly, made a huge difference when they stepped away from the sheep. The good thing is we are in 2015. There's computers. We can connect worldwide right now, as we are. Things have changed. It's time for you, if you're ethical, if you're honest, if you are survival, if you're here to help, if you're here to make a difference, it's time for you to be louder than every person around you. And should they speak up, remember, Every great person was resisted and every great movement was resisted and every time they won because you can't stop truth and you can't stop survival ideas. Pay attention to how you feel right now and compare it to before you watch this video blog. A sense of calm power. Pay attention to the feelings in your body and the feelings in your mind and notice it. That's right. Now own yourself and stop worrying about the opinions of the mediocre. Be the best and fuck the rest. I am C Nation.